It's a big night here at HP Pavilion. Jeremy Roenick, one of the uh, better dressed gentlemen in the house. Is, uh, he's got a good seat. Wings and Sharks coming up in just a few minutes. Kate Longworth is here, and uh, you know, JR may not be playing tonight, but Kate, this is still a very special day for him. That's right. Although he is nursing his shoulder injury, that's not going to stop him from not only celebrating his 39th birthday today, but on Tuesday, he will be making an acting cameo in the TNT TV series drama series Leverage. Now, I had a chance this week after practice to sit down and have a serious chat with JR about his acting role. Then, without him knowing, we took a couple of his teammates and gave them a sneak peek at JR the actor. Take a look at what they had to say. Well, tell me how you decided to dabble in acting. Well, I don't know if it was really my idea. I think being in the prof in the professional world and being in entertainment and sports, I think you get your opportunities are open to different different uh, ventures. And I meet a lot of people along the way, and I've met a lot of people in the showbiz and in movies and TV. And um, getting to be good friends with them, uh, they've offered me roles on different shows and just cameo stuff. Tell me about what we're about to see. Um, well, this is a I, this is a cameo. You know, just a little you know. Guest spot. I play the uh, the bumbling the bumbling security guard at the front desk of the building. Bonsoir. La soirée est ici, no? Oh, excuse me. The rave party. I actually speak French. Uh, I'm afraid you're in the wrong place, Miss. This is an office building. You know where people come to work. I work hard. I'm good. Oh, I'm sure you do. I don't understand. Is that James huh? Woods? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody is tells a, me I look like James you Woods, a, a younger James Woods. Pen. You help Michelle? Yeah, sure, absolutely. Oh. The complete bon cassé, nothing. There is no sick. Timothy Hutton has his little group of people that are, okay, you know, man. they're Alden thieves. CEO, they go out and they, they're floor. heist guy. You see? No, I used to work with ham radios when I was a kid. Ah bon? I'm totally not looking at the monitors or what's going on. She dupes me, and they're allowed to do whatever they do upstairs. So you are my hero. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I look good at my. You know what? I like a lot of my scars and my my cuts in my face are coming out pretty good in this. So watch the double chin. <laughs> watch. This is the off season. Oh. Ooh. Look at that. <laughs> was it? Might be a triple. <laughs> Might be a triple chin there. That was filmed late in the summer, so obviously, you know, I had a whole summer of, of minimal workouts, so I'm obviously a little bit, a little bit heavier. Right yeah, here, when he, right here, yeah, his eyes look kind of psycho. Yeah, was, but watch here when he gets up. Absolutely, this is his best line. Quick, very quick there. Yeah, sure, absolutely. And quick off the chair, very. Foot speed's pretty good. Yeah, right there. Love that part. That's great. That's good. It's natural. <laughs> you know what? That's the best I ever had in my hair. I was in hack one time. My hair was like, like huge. I'm like, I don't think any cops look like that. He did something different with his hair too. It looks better. Yeah, it looks better. It's not so. Uh, well, it's short. That's right. Now it's kind of like, I don't know, 80s, 80ish. You know? There, he's looking pretty sharp there. You know kind of intimidating look to be a security guard, maybe a cop, but I don't think I'd make a good cop in real life, but I sure play a hell of a good cop on TV. He was okay, though. Not bad. I mean, if I didn't know who he was, I would think he did a pretty good job, you know? <laughs> but the guy on the left is way better. <laughs> and my favorite part is when she says, uh, you're good with your hands, huh? You are good with your hands, I think. I'll be like, yes, I'm very good with my hands. Out of five stars, I'd not seeing much more, I'd have to give it a two and a half. I think they're going to say I'm multi-talented. You didn't really have a big role. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's out of three stars, I'll give him a two. I think they're going to say he's good with his with his mind and his hands. Well, and if I out of five, I'd have to give him a one because <laughs> it's a sliding scale. Excuse me. It's really a triple chin if you look at it real closely. That's <laughs> one, two, three. yeah. That's really. It's not doing it for me, so I'm gonna have to give him two out of five stars. Yeah, I think they're gonna say, this is, you might have a, you might have a job somewhere else after hockey. JR, you're gonna have to come back to us next year because the acting job just is not gonna work for you, bro. Not at all. Come back to us next year. Sure, absolutely.